Hello everyone, it is me, it is Sharpie Puss Potato coming at you right now, and we are back with Ghosts of Tsushima. I hope you're enjoying. Uh, as you can see, I am rocking the Gusaku armor this time. We've got the red, uh, the red tint of color dye on here. We've got the white sword uh, with the white hilt and yeah the white casing as well and our red and black bow so we are ready as you may remember we uh we recently explored this village remember we um we liberated it just before we logged off so that is where we're resuming just here in the moonlight with jun sakai whoa there we go straight away into action he loves it okay so it's been a while since i've uh, hopped in this to be honest uh but we're going to do it. We are going to... Mongols and bandits are bad enough, but groups of straw hat ronin? That's not good. That's not good for business. So we were actually down here. We were doing the quest for... Uh, what's her name? Yuna. Uh, here, sorry. But since we're up here, Masaka is here. So when... When Masako is close by, we can help her out. So yeah, I thought I'd switch the armor up a bit. Just because, you know, I, I figured like maybe every episode we can be rocking an a different set of armor or something like that. Just to keep things fresh and saucy, you know? Come on, Nobu. Gotta find our way out of here. Oh, sorry, Mr. Fisherman. Oh, not a fisherman. Come on, Nobu, you can do it. Find the way out, Nobu. Where is it? There's a bridge somewhere. Here, here we go. Okay, and we're off. Um, so with the sound, I've adjusted it again. I know I keep doing this, but I'm trying to find that perfect point. So uh, the sound in the game should be louder now, uh, more consistently loud. However, um, my voice should just be slightly above it. So it shouldn't duck in and out as much so it shouldn't as be it shouldn't be as distracting as it was before sort of thing so yeah as usual let me know feedback is very much welcome and uh yeah let's get through it and uh it's late so i need to whisper no i don't i don't really but you know it is late but not too late it's just gone 11 so i think i'll play for like an hour Oh, nice waterfall there. Reminds me of Death Stranding. Whoa, that's a big drop. Looks like there's some stuff down there. That I, there's a person down there. Is that Lady Masako? Nah, she wouldn't be down there. So I need to get across here, I guess. Okay, no boot. Let's see if we can find a way across. Probably just here. It's not too deep. Oh, it's too deep. Sorry, Nobu, I'm swimming across. Oh, the current is taking me a little bit. Uh, we can just go up here. Adio. Oh, Pfft, lol. I meant to grapple onto that, but it didn't didn't appear for me to grapple onto. Oh well, we didn't die. It's fine. And then Nobu will magically appear behind me because he is a magician. Good Nobu. Good Nobu the Magician. Oh, this is nice. I like this place. Uh oh, straw hats. I'm right here. Let's take on these straw hats. Show them who's boss. Oh, can't see. Oh, gosh, that, that frightened me then because I, I was just about to say. Oh, no. I, I, I was just about to say I couldn't see his feet, so it was hard to. They, they are tough, these straw hats, you know. Jesus. Oh my god. Wow. These straw hats are lethal, man. I, I, I know I whacked up the difficulty a bit, but yeah. Jeez Louise. Um, yeah, what I was going to say is um, I, I noticed something. That when you're in these jewels, if you 
uh, look at their feet when they're trying to, uh, you know, trick you. That's how you can actually see if they're about to move by watching their feet. Because if they move their feet, it means they're going to attack. But if they don't move their feet and they just move their upper body, then they won't attack. Okay, that was better. It was hard before because there was that really long grass in the way and I couldn't I couldn't actually see, you know. No, stop it, stop it. Let's see if we can pick one off. Oh no, missed. No, you don't. These uh, guys dodge a lot more than the other ones, you know? guys are lethal. I like the difficulty though, it, it does make it more like intense because before I was kind of just like you know playing with them sort of thing like just you know waiting for them to sort of just make a mistake and I could you know probably still use some of my um, kunai knives and stuff like that to even the odds but I do uh, I, I like just trying to you know use the sword fighting to kind of keep it keep it saucy what's that Spinning. okay uh i'm wondering if we should climb in an upper window or something oh let's just go through the door anything here what's that cabbage jin doesn't want the cabbage oh dear he's injured Save your strength. My lord. Help. Why did the Ronin attack? I, I don't know. They forced the men here to go with them. They took my husband, Oda. Do you know where they went? They talked about going to a gorge in the north. Please save my Oda. Final request. Okay, let's do it. So there she we go. must mean Hollow Gorge. Thieves use it for smuggling and selling slaves. Okay, to Hollow Gorge it is then. Where you at, Nobu? Nobu, where are you? There he is. Lovely. Okay. Oh, it's quite a distance away, but okay. We need to explore the map. Through the forest. This is a nice looking forest, isn't it? Reminds me of uh, in World of Warcraft, it's a place called Grizzly Hills, and it's this sort of colour scheme. It's nice, like very bright green and like luscious brown. Morning brown, morning brown. Get a cup of that morning brown. Oh, what's happening there? Ah, I like it when this happens. Did they kill the bear? They did. So now I will kill them. 
Ooh, he's got flames. That was close. Lovely. Lovely jubbly. And Mr. Bear. Let us thank Mr. Bear. Please forgive me. Please forgive me, Mr. Bear, but I needed your hide, frankly. I will use your hide to slaughter the Mongols who attacked you. And that's the thing, you know. I was not guilty of killing that bear. That bear was a victim of a hate crime. I just avenged him. Oh, that looks nice. Look at that. That lake. All these deers. Oh, deers. Stop making so much noise. Give me away. Oh, there's a fire here. I should probably go across the river. Hello. Oh, of course. Yeah. Try to be clever and... I jump into a shallow part. This looks nice. Oh, look, there's snow over there. I wonder if you go into the snow. There is like a snowy part here. Let's go, Nobu. Oh. Who's that? Who's that? Pigs. Oh, only two of them. Usually they come in packs of three. But I do need their hides as well. Got to upgrade all the gear and stuff. Legend Storyteller. Oh, okay, so I can come back here. Oh, it's a little camp there. I should probably go in there. It might allow me to... Whoa! Oh, bro might allow me to, like, come back here. Or well, not. I thought it was a camp, but it's like an abandoned camp, so... Yeah, not much here. So it's um it's coming up to Friday. The Friday before Christmas. It is the uh Christmas well it's Christmas Day in Poland on the Sunday. Aha. Whereas in the UK it'll be on the Monday, I guess, twenty fifth, won't it? Look at his feet, look at his feet. Oh! Oh, oh! Gosh, I totally buggered that up. I wasn't watching. Okay. Could have gone a lot better. I, uh, for some reason, that second guy just wasn't paying attention. I was thinking about Christmas. Look at this. It's Nobu's brother. Or mum. Looks like an old, an old no Nobu. Actually, they both look kind of the same. But Nobu's cooler, obviously. You wouldn't swap Nobu, that's for sure. No boo, no booty like no boo. There's no booty like no boo. Nobody like no boo. Ah, no boo, my dude. Ooh, this is nice. It's very red. Look how, wow, look how red it got. Ah, my eyes. Even my eyes on the stream went red because it's so red. It's nice though. It's like dramatic red. Oh, here they are. Try to stand off with them. I just like these standoffs. They're so cool. Mm. 
not this time. It was a fabrication. It never happened. That was nice. One thing that uh, I have started noticing is if you pay attention to the blood splatters on the ground when um, they they are actually very realistic. Um, I noticed this because I watched it. Oh, he's going to run away. What's he doing? Oh my god. Where is he? Ooh. Okay. Um, so, as I was saying, sorry, <laughs> I always have to pay attention when I'm in these uh, sword fights. I can't talk and cannot multitask. Um, I was watching a YouTube video about uh, the actor who uh, plays Jin Sakai in this, and uh, he was doing like sword training. And one thing they mentioned is that um, they couldn't show it on YouTube, but um, oh, this is the camp. Oh, I probably shouldn't have done that. I think I can get down here. Yeah, um, the 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 blood, the way it animates based on the type of cut is very realistic and the way it like splatters along the floor and stuff is like super realistic and it's kind of they said it's worrying how they got it so realistic because amazing, yeah but they they said that they did a lot of practicing with uh you know not not real life killing obviously but you know maybe like putting uh you know uh buckets of paint in i don't know like sacks and stuff and then like whacking it open with a samurai sword just to see how it splatters cool very detailed were you taken from the inn no my lord they passed this way but headed east do you know where they mentioned some cliffs near the river i know that place take supplies from the camp and get to safety okay So I need to go and search the Ronin atop the cliff. So probably I can get this way. Sorry, Nobu, I called you for no reason. No, I didn't. One second. Because there's a jumpy thing here. But maybe it's for the other direction. Oh no, I can do it this way. Oh, wrong one. There we go. Anything here? No. Our armor matches with like camouflage in here. If I just like, you know, get down, no one will see me. Um, I'm just looking at the volume. I, I'm wondering if I can even put the volume up a little bit more for the uh, thing we do here. One second. Do that. Okay, so I've turned the volume up a tiny bit more so it's got a bit more volume on it. Is this the inn it wants me to check? Or not? No, this is a different inn. Very nice here. Ooh, look. Samurai base. With straw hats as well. Oh, that's that, uh... Castle Shimmera. That's, like... Where I need to be heading eventually, but... Not yet. Shall I, uh, shall I? Why shouldn't I, after all? Boom, headshot. Ha 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 ha. What's he waiting for? There we go. 
Oh, look at him. He got absolutely burnt to a cinder, that guy. Um, okay. We can call Nobu now, I think. I thought it was closer. Nice scenery here. Very nice. I feel like I'm on a sort of a nature exhibit, Na nature documentary. Oh, pigs! Wrong, wrong bow, wrong bow, get the right bow. Where's the other one? You're not getting away from me, piggy. There we go. He ran into my sword. And where'd the third one go? Third one was around here somewhere. Where did he go? That camouflage in the grass somewhere. One, two. Ah, there it is. And a tree. Okay, so this is the place probably. Let's uh, do a bit of stealth instead. Fancy uh, being a bit stealthy. Actually, this is going to be ridiculously hard to be stealthy here. They're all clumped up so closely. I might be able to do like one. Whoa! Okay, that was the leader. That was cool. So, because I killed the leader, that makes it nice and easy. Because usually they are the tough ones. Oh, he got rinsed. Actually, they all got rinsed. That was that was clean. That was a clean, swift kill of everyone. That was that was nice. Love it. Jinseke does not mess around. That's for sure. Jinseke. Okay. Uh, are they flowers I can pick up? No, they're just pretty flowers. Where to now? 150 meters, so I'm close. Just over this hill, probably that little thing I can see there. Yeah, here they are. Those are the cliffs where the Ronin went. Sorry, Mr. Straw Hat, but you guys are just as less honourable than me when I'm doing this. <clears throat> they will spot us for sure. Do 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 do. Around the back. If we can get this one. Catch him off guard. I mean, how can he see anything wearing that? Okay, we might be able to get him as well. Oh, never mind. Ooh, that one can dodge that. Yeah! <laughs> 
Oh, dear. I, <laughs> Gosh, I, I get so in, into into the combat in this game that I, I just go into pure concentration mode. Never stood a chance, my lord. You're safe now. Thank you, my lord. These Ronin deserve death. They killed innocent people at the inn. I recognize some of them. They used to serve Clan Yarikawa. Survivors of the rebellion. And still traitors to their own people. There are more of us nearby. The Ronin took Hoa, Hyoe, and Oda. Then Oda's alive. If any were killed here, tend to the bodies, and then go somewhere safe. Open the box, collect some stuff. Okay, I think we're good. I think we are good. But all the places in this game, like even this little place, it's just like so nice that you wouldn't even mind living here, like outside, you know, just sleeping in these little things. It, it just looks so nice and like I don't know peaceful and what's that word where it's like um begins with s it's just like means that it's um uh, like so quiet and there's a, a word for it I can't it's not coming to my head but leave it in the comments if you know what word I'm talking about uh yeah it's going to drive me mental now, I'm going to be thinking of that, but yeah. Okay, I'm just going to pause it one second, because I just want to change the sound up a tiny bit. Let's try something out. Okay, there we go. So I just tried something, just to, um... Because with the talking, uh, I've just tried to enable something, so, like, um... If the volume is too low when they're talking, it, tr it should try to, like, automatically raise it a bit, but it's, it's difficult to do, because in this game, some of the talking is just quiet like even for me I have to like you know turn it up a little bit to hear sometimes so it's hard to balance it to be honest oh, is there somewhere okay let's do another stealth mission oh lots of them here Could even try this guy real quick because it's uh, leader again and then let's do this oh what's going on i can't can't dodge A nasty one. Oh dear. The sword fights are pretty intense now, one on one. To be honest, they they really do dodge a lot of your attacks. My lord, sort of here we go. My lord, please, you must hurry to the inn. My wife was wounded. I spoke to her. Is she? Her final thoughts were of you. Oh no, my poor sweet wife. <laughs> her death was avenged. These Ronin will never hurt anyone again. Thank you, my lord. I need to see her one last time and say goodbye. And there we go. That's a nice little storyline. Lots of killing involved in that. Lots of straw hats came to their end. And some Mongols as well. So, yeah, pretty good, pretty good. They have some cleaning up to do with these bodies though, that's the only thing. 
I left a lot of bodies in my way. I wonder what my kill count is now of Mongols. Pretty sure I must be on some kind of record on the island. Okay, and I'm back. So, um, yeah, I just tried mucking around with the settings a bit there. Uh, let's go to Lady Misako next, because we wanted to do that at the beginning. So yeah, the the it should be a bit better now because I I realised. Sorry, we'll do his story later. Uh, right now, we're on our way to Masako. Um, so I, I didn't realise I didn't have it, so the volume ducked when I spoke, so it was not working as it should have. But now it should be. Need to go around this thing, I think. Oh, some visas here, but honestly, I don't need to take them. Oh, no I'll take them. Oh my. Oh, there's loads of them here. That guy's massive. Look at his health. Oh, that's his stagger bar, never mind. But still, that's impressive. Are throwing all this junk at me. There we go. You'll be free soon. Oh dear. There's no escaping them, my lord. They control every road in and out of here. You there you go. The... You. Yes. I was following the path, and they were camped nearby, waiting for travelers. Find a safe spot in the wilds until I've cleared the roads. There we go. I think the volume should be much better now. Uh, so yeah, that's good, that's good. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, so he had a little quest for me. Sorry if I keep, like, just I thought they'd kill me. pausing and doing nothing. I am actively adjusting the volumes and stuff. Because I, I just want to get that voice volume so you can hear the voices, like, much better sort of thing. Ooh, look, there's some supplies in this little boat. I think whoever uh, the team was, like, who were designing the map and everything in it must have had a really cool time, like, to just, like, you know, plant different little shrines in different places and, like, I don't know, it just seems like a really fun world to sort of design, to be honest, like, really nice that you'd actually enjoy designing this. Oh, heard something. Oh, it's a bear. Sorry, Mr. Bear, but... Oh, that was one shot. Blimey. Sorry, but I do need your predator hides. That was a Mongol bear. It was trained. Is a suspicious Baloo. Baloo the bear. What's going on up here? A little campsite. Ooh, should I go up here? This looks interesting, doesn't it? Hey. 
anything up here? Looks like a really cool place for a screenshot. That's nice, like with all the different colored trees there, isn't it? Got like red, white, yellow, green. Nice. And the Buddha statue there as well, massive Buddha statue. Cool place. Looks like you can go even higher actually. Shall we? Shall we try? Going to the top. It's like Death Stranding, you know? Going to the top of those mountains. Whoop. Put in those, uh, what were those systems called? Uh, oh, look, there's a banner up here. That with those banners, you hand them in and you get like new stuff for Nobu. Doesn't look like there's nothing here, but it's like a cool photo opportunity, probably. That's a cool photo, isn't it? Just like that, maybe. Maybe even back a little bit. Yeah, could make a nice one there. Yep, that's cool. Like it. Okay. Uh, should we go down this way? Ooh. Well, that was the end of me. Jin Sakai's adventure came to a drastic end as he slipped off a cliff. Um, I wonder, how do I get down here safely then? Because to me it looks like I should be able to land on that, but I can't, okay. So we're going back down the same way, I guess. Unless it wants me to grapple onto that. Maybe I can, maybe I can grapple on. Maybe I've just got to aim it. Come on, come on. Oh, okay, so you can. Just trying to trick you. Oh no, it doesn't want me to move. There we go. Oh, I didn't mean to even go over here. I don't even know what's up here. It looks like there should be something up here, but it's kind of not, is there? It's like nothing up here apart from like good photo opportunities. That's it. Yeah, I really don't know what the deal is with this place. Maybe you come up here later or something. Maybe it's a future, future thing to explore. Okay, that should be where my sucker is, where that Buddha is, I think. Omi Monastery. I hear Fox. Oh, hello, Mr. Fox. Yeah, come on, show me the way. He's going to take me back up the mountain, isn't he? No, he's not. Taking me somewhere else. Where is he taking me? Aha! Where'd he go? I lost him. Oh look, he's gone in there. I never would have spotted that. Where'd he go now? I've lost him. Did he go up? Oh, here he is. Oh, look at that. That's pretty cool. See, that's what I mean. Just even like this. Like, you know, whoever just designed this. Like, that's so cool, no? With that Buddha and everything. That's just badass, honestly. Got some U wood there. We can drop down here and get that stuff as well. like this is a world that you'd want to live in I think apart from all the Mongols like that would be a problem but if the Mongols weren't about it just looks like such a peaceful and that word I want to say again gosh not scenic not scenic there's another word it's uh oh what is it it's on the tip of my tongue I just cannot think of it not ceramic. 
Ah, oh, gosh, I can't remember. I'm going to annoy myself. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're probably screaming at the monitor. It's this word. But either way, uh, where's Masako at? That's, that's more important right now than words. It's not full to our death. Oh, God. Like that. How did she know I was there so fast? Consumed with my own pain. Masako, what's wrong? A man named Kachiwara recruited the men who killed my family. His name is on the list. He lives in this prefecture. That monk knows where, but he won't tell me. Junshin means well. I'll talk to him. Okay, let's talk to the monk. Junshin, it's good to see you. And you, Lord Sakai. Lady Masako and I are looking for Kajiwara. You know where he is. She accused him of terrible things. I he fear did. for his life if she finds him. Masako has good reason to believe he recruited the men who killed her family. Hmm. He would never do that. Yeah, he would. He is a humble fisherman, a loving husband and father. I think she is blinded by rage. Jushin, I need to talk to him. As long as it is just talking. <laughs> Can't make any promises there, my dude. The family man. But that's the thing, you know? There is a lot of betrayal going on in this, so... You know, if the Mongols have moved from here to the coast, Kajiwara's hut is on the beach. If the Mongols have threatened his family, then we'll take the road to the coast. You know, everyone has a price. Thank you for your help, monk. Peace be with you, Lady Masako. That sounded condescending, but okay. I can't imagine what you said to Junshin that I didn't. He doesn't even try to hear me. It's like talking to a stone. I think he's afraid of you. Afraid? <laughs> Why? You can be intimidating. In our world, that is not a bad thing. We're hunting a cruel and vicious man. He was a retainer for our clan. Dependable and skilled, but quick to anger. We excused his behavior until the day I caught him beating his wife and daughter. The coward. Her coward. Family. I dismissed him immediately. I offered his wife and daughter refuge in our house. Within a day, they'd gone back to him. It's not always easy, especially when you think they'll change. This path should take us to the beach. We'll leave the horses to avoid being seen. We should approach with caution. I don't want to put Kajiwara's family at risk. I don't think she cares about that, to be fair. I think we're going to put everyone at risk here. Oh, this way. That must be Kajiwara's fishing hut. Kajiwara. They may have already killed him and his family. There's a chance they're still alive. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, who have we got here? Let's get the old longbow out. I don't want to stand off. I want to stealth it up. Kill this geezer. Oh, lol. That wasn't very subtle, but well, I guess it was. No one heard, so. Gosh. Oh dear, I'm on fire, I'm on fire. Oh. Whoa. Gosh, the 
fire. Gotta kill these archers, they drive me crazy. And this guy. Oh, my sacco's getting rids. Okay, gosh, that was intense. Let's check the house for Kajiwara and his family. Misako went flying all over the place then. That's good though, I enjoyed that. I do like that stance, that is my favourite stance, this one, where he's like this, because he just goes mental. Look at that, like that combo is just lethal. It's really good against those shield ones. Um, and I always forget about the brute one because the brute one's pretty cool as well. Like, look, that spinny attack. That's really good. I always forget about using those ones though. That's something I need to get used to a bit. Okay. This blade is covered in blood. It oh, doesn't no. look like a Mongol weapon. It's a fisherman's tool. Okay, I think I've got the voices pretty this must spot be on, hopefully. Wife and daughter. I always feared this would be their fate. Maybe the Mongols killed them? Then where is Kajiwada's body? Uh, I think the volume might be you good now. Cloth. Not cloth. Silk. More than a humble fisherman could afford. Ah, see, the Mongols have bought him out with nice things. Um... Because what I was saying, like, uh, it, it just goes a little bit quieter now, so it should be easier to hear the game while I'm talking still. Mazako, footprints leading away from the hut. What if Kajiwara survived? Ran like a coward. Let's follow the footprints. And also should be a bit louder, like the voices now as well. Okay, so this way. Oh, hello, hello. Lady Masago! The Mongols attacked! My wife and daughter! Quiet, Snake! We know you killed them. Out of love. Better me than the Mongols. It's what they wanted. You hmm. sick jinn! You recruited the assassins who killed my family! Who hired you? Tell me and I will end you lovingly, like you did your wife and daughter. All I know is... He understood. Understood what? How it feels to be ruined by you. How I was driven to poverty. The toll it took on my family. How... There we go. I couldn't stand to hear another word. Everything he said was a lie. Except about being ruined by me. I know Sadao felt <laughs> the same way. He got wrecked. The spirits are bonded by hate. The attack on your clan was personal. Organized by a rival samurai with a deep grudge. But I can't think of who. You'll find him. That's right, Nobu. Have a nice bite to eat. The family man. Family man. Family man. Oh, I forgot we got a samurai point. We can use that. We can upgrade something. Also, I really need to start looking into these charms. Okay, uh, let's get a new technique. That's one of these, maybe. I was thinking of the Kanai one, because I'm using Kanai's a lot. And with this one, it just means that you hit more people at once. So that one might be good. Let's get that. Okay, um, sorry, where are we heading? Or was that the end of, oh, that was the end of that fairy tale, that was. Riverside Farms, that's where she mentioned. Um, we can upgrade some stuff, maybe. What's this? Oh, that's the Black Dime Merchant. Um, because we could head down south to... 
tower again. Journey to the pass. Can we teleport here or not yet? No. See, I don't have many places I can teleport to nearby these next quests. Uh, so I need to ride there. However, I would like to do something. Maybe let's just head here. We haven't been here, this ghost of the pass. So let's head there. Maybe we can finish it there actually. What's the time? I can't see how long I've been streaming for because um, I stopped and started recording a few times. But um, it's probably been near about an hour. So yeah, we can head there and maybe finish off the episode. Until next time. See what we find along the way. Let's go through the forest. Maybe go climbing. Let's do a bit of climbing. Oh, we're back at the monastery. See if that bird takes us anywhere. Sorry for ruining the sand. I know that that's quite a... That was it, it's just taking me here. Maybe there's something inside? Something underneath? Nope. Oh, even this would be such a cool little place to live, no? We're just like raking the sand. Zen. Maybe that's the word I was looking for, Zen. No, I don't think it was. I think it began with Ness. It could be Zen. Oh, look at all these things. Are they cranes or herons or something? I think they're cranes, no? Uh, okay, enough mucking around. Let's uh, let's go. Where you at, Nobu? Oh, I can't even call Nobu here. We need to get out of this place. Get out of this place. If it's the last thing I ever do. Looks like there's something in here. Iron. Ooh. That was a lot. There he is. No boo on the run. No boo on the run. Whoops. Oh, this is nice as well. Oh, you know what this reminds me of? The Last Samurai. Do you remember that when they're coming through? Or, or the, oh, sorry, Mr. Dear. Uh, where the samurai at the beginning, the first time you see them and they're coming through that forest with all that fog and light behind them. So epic. Home. Oh, this is where he grew up. Ah, oh, so he's home. This is back home. Oh, this is a nice home. Look at these white trees. That's nice. Matches Nobu. Look at this. Like, just little things like that, that little waterway. Just, I don't know, little things like that I love about this game. Just little details like that. That's why I think I should play uh, Red Dead Redemption again, because that also had uh, amazing, like, attention to detail in that game. His armor is gone. How dare you! Yuriko? Oh. Who's that? Young master! I feared you were dead! <laughs> I came as soon as I could. It's good to see you, Yuriko. You look tired. Are you hungry? Not now. <laughs> Thank you. 
The Khan's army must have marched past here. Have you had any trouble? A few bandits. Nothing I can't take care of. I've come for my father's... my armor. You refused to wear it at Komoda Beach. A lot has changed since then. I hid it somewhere safe. Ooh. Ghosts from the past. This is going to be a cool one, I think. But I think this is going to be an episode for next time, you know. Come this way. These old bones. Them bones, them bones, them old bones. But that's like typical Nana, that is. Like, you turn up out of nowhere and show off your food straight away in the middle of the night. He's at the cemetery. What's he doing there? Tending the grounds. Gathering plants for my poisons. Keeps vermin out of our food stores. I'm glad you're not alone. What about Lord Shimura? Alive. The Mongols captured him at Komoda. But we freed him. Oh. Others survived. And they're helping you? A few. Lady Musical. Good. She's been fighting alongside the boys since she was knee-high. <laughs> You'll have to tell me more about that someday. But it's just the two of you? A few others. Sensei Ishikawa. Ishikawa. I haven't seen him in years. Does he still act like he's the only one who knows how to do things? Half the time he's right. <laughs> his name is unmatched. He would certainly agree. Lord Sakai, you're back! I, I wish I could you. stay. But I hear you're taking good care of Yuriko. You've got that backwards, my lord. Taichi, help me get the Sakai armor. Go. I should pay my respects. Is it your father's grave? The weeds haven't been pulled. I'm sorry. Our lord finally... Gosh, I want to go to bed, but it's just too... Too nice to not. But look at this, just looks so cool with all the different coloured leaves and stuff. Uh, I'm gonna miss this game when it's uh, all over to be honest. Like, just such a beautiful game. Look at this. Like, just the artwork that they've done here and like as you run through the leaves just, you know, coming up in your... Look at that. So awesome. Compose haiku. Here we go. Haiku. <laughs> Reflect on legacy. Let's do this. This can be our haiku before we go to bed. I mourn my father. Light for my father. That one's better. Light for my father. We used to meditate here. His grave close, his soul distant. No, we used to meditate here, that's nice. Memories. Now I am alone. All things pass away. This old tree lives on. That's nice, yeah. The tree. Light for my father. We used to meditate here. This old tree lives on. I'd say that was a, a positive haiku. And there we go. Oh, look, the leaves started coming around me when I did the bow. Did you see? They like swirling around me. I think we're appropriately coloured. Apart from the mask, that's a bit weird. But, um, you know, we will... I, I chose a good colour to wear this episode, I feel. It, it just matches everything that we 
needed to do and where and places we needed to go. Okay, uh, go back to Yariko. We'll just see what she wants to say before we go to bed. I love these little ponds like this with the little lily pads and the candles floating in them. That's the the armor's inside, my lord. Thank you, Taichi. Ooh, new armor, new armor. Is it going to be good? I'm sure it is. Ooh, looks cool. That looks pretty badass. got to be pretty intense. No one's going for it. Ghost of Tushima. Badass. That's the stuff. Master? Are you all right? Yes, just lightheaded. For a moment, I thought you looked. Face us, coward! Oh. Well, it looks like I get to test out the armor. Lacquer mask worn by the greatest samurai of the Sekai clan. Sekai clan armor for the leader of Sekai clan, previously worn by Jin's father, Kazumasa Sakai. Show me your skill. I want that helmet that his dad had though, that looked badass. Can't, can't fail wearing my dad's armor, I need to... Yeah, there we go, that's the way it should be done. Yuriko! Perfect. Lord Sakai! Are you alright? You butchered them! Is hmm. Yarikawa giving us trouble again? The Yarikawa rebellion was 20 years ago. Those men were with the Mongols. Of course. Seeing you like that. Still shaken up. I need to catch my breath. By the lake. Your favorite tree. Yes. Come. You said earlier you've been making poisons. Keeps the vermin out of our rice. Can you make it stronger? Enough to kill a man? No one deserves that. Can you do <laughs> it? The effects in larger doses are ugly. Good. Oh, oh, this I'm... is where we trained at the beginning, in the memory. Sit with me a moment. Poison has never been the Sakai way. No Sakai had to fight the Mongol Empire. I need every weapon we have. Tsushima can't afford anything less. The Mongols have changed you, young master. The world has changed. My mother taught me about plants that heal, others that harm, even kill. But they must be consumed. How will you poison the invaders? A blowgun and darts. Ooh. I 
I've read of their use by a Genji warrior who studied with monks from the West. Will you help me? Promise me you'll remain the good man I know. I promise. <laughs> Was that a legit promise? Looked after your every need since your mother I'm not carried. sure. I won't stop now. All I need is something to make a blowgun. Mm, used to be a lot of reeds on the other side of the lake. Where the old fishermen lived. Remember? You and your little friend gathered them to make little boats. Yuzo and I. We spent all day reenacting the Battle of Dunnoda. Be careful, Jin. I've seen fires over there at night. Ooh. Not sure who it is. Don't worry. I'll be back soon with reeds. I'll wait for you here. Okay. Well, I think that that is a perfect place to leave it. We've got this cool new armor. I will uh, maybe modify it a bit. I'm thinking I'm, I'm not too keen on the headpiece, but the mask is cool, but the headpiece needs to be a bit more epic. So I think that's going to be our next adjustment. But anyway, I hope very much you enjoyed this episode. And um, yeah, this one will probably actually come out after Christmas, to be honest, because I'm recording this like on the Friday before Christmas. However, I've got another two episodes that I need to release. So even though I'm talking about Christmas in here, uh, I just hope that you had a very nice Christmas. I hope that you um, had lots of nice food, nice company. Maybe had some nice presents, watched some nice TV. Overall, I hope you had a nice time. And I hope that the new year is maybe good for you. Maybe the new year has been already by the time you're watching this video. Who knows? So, thank you very much for watching. Have a good morning, good afternoon, a good evening, or a good night. And I shall see you next time. I've been Sharpie Puss Potato. You've been you. Thank you very much, and peace.